Yo, what's going on guys? Lottery Stocks here. Today we got another GameStop price prediction for you guys. Diamond Hands. Obviously these price predictions are just to get you guys like a better look at what's going to happen the next trading day. But in the end, I assume we're all holding. Um, yeah guys, I know some of you guys in the comments say technical analysis doesn't work. Maybe I'll start labeling these um, titles different or just check the description pretty sure I list that it's technical analysis. Um, the reason I don't go off catalogs and catalysts is because we don't know what's like most of the catalysts for GameStop end up playing against our favor, not against our favor, but against with what we expect. Like if there was a catalyst that we expected to be positive for us, we're just going to see it play down because of manipulation. And I don't want to tell you guys, oh, there's a positive catalyst coming out. That's the only reason I do technical analysis. Because it's plain and simple, right out there, clear as day. What do you think this shop, this stock should be at tomorrow's trading day? And that's what I'm going to give you guys right now. Right now, before we get into this video, you guys see I'm on Weeble. This is Weeble. There's real-time data. And if you want free stocks and if you want this... Then hit that link in the description to download Weeble and deposit your first hundred. You'll get two free stocks for signing up and two free stocks for depositing. And yeah, guys, there you have it. Also, it's free to hit that like button. You don't have to deposit. Um, it also is free to hit uh, hit that subscribe button and join the Lottery Stocks fam. I've been getting some good comments and we talk back and forth. If you guys have any questions, drop them in the comments. I'm going to answer you. And here we go. I didn't really draw anything yet. I just wanted to go over this with you guys right now and make this a quick video it doesn't have to be super long in the morning we've seen this big dip right here dip to spike back up that's sort of common with gamestop now if we're in the five minute chart you guys see how today and yesterday were sort of different because we're kind of trading flat for two days trading flat for two days which yeah, it seems like GameStop does that a lot. But the past week, it's just been a one-day downtrend. You guys see this? And this is the first day it's consolidating. So I believe, quote me if I'm wrong, but this consolidation is actually good for us, guys. Because what it's showing is that pretty much this and between this, we can't drop too much lower. We can, yeah, we may see some drops I'm going to be honest, we're, we may see a drop um, any time the rest of the week. But in reality, it can't drop much lower because the stocks everyone's holding, if you guys are holding and not selling, there's a floor. There's a floor we're holding at. And this floor is not able to be broken. And that's why, I mean, if it was able to go lower than the floor we're holding at, then hedges could just manipulate it down and buy back at what they shorted it at. So obviously that's not the case. If that was the case, then they would just do that and this would be over with already. So yeah, guys, I think we're seeing this consolidation. We're getting sort of close to our floor price. And I don't see I don't see another flat day tomorrow, if I'm being honest, guys. Tomorrow, I'm going to say, okay, okay. I'm going to say tomorrow or Thursday. One of these, we're going back up to our 190s range. And I know that sounds a little bit biased just because I'm holding the stock. But really, guys, and and I'm not being biased here. I just want to just want to say this could be our floor somewhere around here. Not only that, if it goes sideways or dips another day, we're eventually hitting this floor. And I'm going to see a bounce soon. Um. Another thing I would like to say, guys, is when we do hit that floor price, let's say, let me zoom out to the one hour. This, this looks, let's say this is our floor price. Um, We'll say 110 is, that's a fair deal. 110 to... 90s 110 is what we hold at if it ever drops to 110 i think we're triggering the squeeze once it hits 110 guys if it does hit 110 or close to that i think we're going to trigger the squeeze because the hedge funds know what the closest 
what the cheapest buyback point they can actually get the stock to is. And once they get to that, they're going to make their move. They don't have any other options. So pretty much since you guys get annoyed with the technical analysis part of things, um, if you're wondering about Catalyst, the 420 share recount, that could be good or that could leave us static and it shouldn't be bad for us. And as of when the squeeze should happen, we're actually waiting on the SEC to pass a few things. And it's not, I don't know if they're on our side. I think they just want to have their own backs and they don't want to go bankrupt. So I think we got, I think we got this in the bag guys. Monday, I'll give you a final prediction. Monday, if you start seeing spikes in pre-market, expect drops through the day. That's my price prediction for Monday. All in all, forget Monday. If I don't drop a price prediction for tomorrow, here's what I'm expecting. No matter what, I'm expecting up tomorrow. I'm expecting spikes. Hopefully back to our 190s range. I'm not going to say it's going to be a total flat road, but maybe maybe a, maybe a five-point corrective wave. And don't take what I drew in drew here into account i'm just talking overall but maybe a five point impulse wave and instead of five corrective waves just three small corrective waves and pushes up to our 190s range so there you guys have it i appreciate you guys watching this video and if you have any questions in the comments you know or if you even i mean if you want to hate throw those comments out i don't really mind you know what i'm saying you, you clicked on the video but yeah, guys, I appreciate you watching. Lottery stocks out. Well, I get you shot like a movie skip. One shot, he drop a hole like a hell. We gon' get to this bed when we focus on gunplay, but trapping the zone. We got all of us gon' make your one day like church.